Yes, it was. And what uh, what can you do as an auditor to make uh, your office work for Wyoming and its better? So, how I describe um, this to my neighbor's kids when they ask me what does the state auditor do, I said, you know, think in terms of your parents' checkbook, right? Uh, your parents have money that comes in and goes out, and they have certain guidelines that they have to follow that they've agreed to um, in their marriage and their relationships on how that money should be spent. So the auditor is actually kind of the third party, would be a third party who comes in and would work with your parents to make sure that they're spending money according uh, as to how it should be spent, right? Um, what can the auditor's office do better? Um, this, where, this is where it comes to me in layman's terms on day one. Um, the auditor is currently being sued. Uh, the auditor has two lawsuits against, him, against her uh, for not providing accurate and timely public records. And to me, this is a black eye on the state of Wyoming, and it's an issue that can be solved day one. Um, so my proposal is that I will take the information that the auditor already provides. Um, if you go out to the sao.vendor payment page, or you go out to my website, drforauditor.com backslash checkbook, I actually have a link to this site. And I will take the information that the auditor already provides. There is no violation of HIPAA data. There is no violation of PII at the current time. And I will publish that day one. And the purpose of doing so is to move Wyoming off that F rating in transparency. Um, by doing this, um, it represents a low cost, no cost option to move Wyoming off that F mark. It allows for a group like OpenTheBooks.com to go out and grab that information and pull that information up, like I said, at little to no cost. Wyoming becomes more transparent. Wyoming solves a transparency issue, and Wyoming takes a step forward in informing communities and citizens about how money is spent, and to me, that's a win for everyone. 